And you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted. Make sure to check out my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to head over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. Instead of be covering like three topics in today's video, instead of making it into a bunch of separate videos, I'm trying to get it all into one for you guys. So, first, I'm going to be going over some Mutt Rewards updates and news that they did announce what will be coming out, when will it be coming out, and how will it be uh, structured. Then, I'm going to be going over golden tickets who i think will be coming out tomorrow who are they going to be the reveal golden tickets for tomorrow go over some of their stats what i project and kind of how i expect this to go and then also go over tomorrow's draft night promo ltd type thing because you do know that they did announce there'll be some ltd solos some ltd store store offers as well as some top five draft players that actually end up getting dropped in madden 20 so obviously i have a lot to go over on all that on, the, on that front in general so let's get into all this guys but before we get into today's video make sure you're down below hit that subscribe button turn on that notification boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up as always and if you haven't already comment down below let me know what you guys think of anything i say today or anything you guys want to add and if you guys have been enjoying the content always always like i greatly appreciate that now let's get into the content and let's check out everything i want to show you guys so first Let's start off with the Mutt Reward stuff to get that out of the way real quick. Yeah, okay, so the Mutt Reward stuff, pretty simple. So as you guys can see, there's oh, there's, we have draft packs. That's a known thing already. Draft packs are the promo style packs right here. So I believe what it pretty much came down to was that you're going to get draft picks based on your Mutt Reward status. So the lowest one, maybe like a one pack, top one, three packs. It's going to be very straightforward, very simple as far as Mutt Rewards goes. Those will be dropping tomorrow, which makes sense because tomorrow is draft day. So we'll be getting free draft packs now. What are the draft pack odds? I mean, guys, again, any free pack for me is cool because I don't really, I don't buy packs. I got buy packs of coins. I buy the level of packs, but I really don't buy promo style packs. I bet a lot of you guys don't either. So it's always a fun when you can get some free players and some free packs that you typically couldn't enjoy opening. And tomorrow also golden tickets come out. So you can use these free three packs and maybe get a chance at a golden ticket. It's 100% likely that you will get an 86 or above. It is a 35% chance you get a 90 plus. It's a 50% chance of a 93 plus and even a 5% chance at a 96 plus. These give you some pretty decent odds for golden tickets in my opinion. So if I were you guys, save tomorrow when you get these. If they do come out and golden tickets aren't announced yet, save these for golden tickets tomorrow because these could give you pretty decent odds of pulling them. Obviously, more than likely you're gonna pull a draft player, but you never know. So I would I would I would hold you, I would hold on to them. And again, most people I imagine are like legendary tier, whatever it is. I'm the top tier, and again, I don't really buy packs, so I don't really know how I'm the top tier, but I always am. But I am the top tier, I think because it includes solo challenge packs and free packs and weekend league packs, so it's probably more than likely why. But that'll be my rewards, very simplistic, draft packs tomorrow, stand look out for them, draft night of course. Now let's head on over to the draft night part of this, and then we'll get to the golden tickets. So guys, pretty much this is how draft night will work, notepad NFL draft program. On Monday night only, oh sorry, wow I just blanked, on draft night only the top 5 players from the NFL draft will be released in game so that pretty much means tomorrow night at 8 p.m when they draft the first five players so let's say it takes from eight to nine for the first five players because the first five players could take a while let's go let's go a little bit like maybe 40 minutes for the first five players so let's say joe burrow tua chase young jeff okuda isaiah simmons they all get drafted only those top five players drafted will be released as a mutt usable card tomorrow night after that all the rest of the first round and so on will probably be released the following night or so as madden works on because obviously i mean 32 players on the spot is a little bit hard to make but that's how that's gonna work but like so like i said the top five players will be in game so if you have a top five draft pick picks one through five you will be getting your player tomorrow night to play with depending on who it is as well as if you do the sets for one of them you will be getting a top five player if you get the nap pick collectible you will be getting a top five player guys gonna be super super cool that we get those players and let's see the following day the mutt team will release the remaining 27 players like i said in the afternoon or evening more than likely the evening make sure to follow ea uh, sports underscore mutt on twitter for updates draft pick players are playable collectibles so your draft picks you don't have to put them into a set literally the second they become available they will become usable players which is super awesome and draft class 20 sets will work collectible that morph into an appropriate player once he's drafted guys and beyond that there's some more stuff to go over for tomorrow we will be getting like we might be getting a blitz event because i did see there will be limited time store offers tomorrow night at 8 p.m so that means we'll be getting limited time store offers there will be limited time solos and there will be the draft it's going to be a super fun time now the blitz during the draft kind of sucks i kind of want to watch the draft so i don't know what the thought process is on that but still super super cool that we are getting all this hopefully it's super fun if it is a blitz that's fine i'm what all i want guys is a limited time solo that gets you a pick that's all I will care. Like a nice free solo. It's like play the solo, uh, just like the shoe solo, and you can get a pick. 
that either that you get one pick to 32 so everyone gets one who couldn't spend money or they do it like really like the shoe solo where you literally do a pick and you either get coins or you get like a top five pick it's like very like very very exclusive that'd be fun too but guys beyond even all that i am super excited for the draft promo despite everything because i'm super excited for the draft tomorrow i'm a giants fan they have a, they have an early pick tomorrow so gotta watch that gotta be on top of that i really want to see where a lot of guys go like joe burrow tua chase young all those guys super excited to see where everyone's gonna go love herbert it's gonna be it's gonna be a fun draft great wide receiver class a lot of teams are gonna get really really good after this year based on this draft because there's some really good players in this draft so pretty much it for that let's head over to my golden ticket predictions and what i think will be released tomorrow if we release tomorrow is free safety calvin johnson we have not gotten either one of the calvins and last week we did get bo jackson which is offensive we got michael vick which is offensive and honestly guys Cravon leblanc was a cornerback but we've not gotten many of the defensive bangers yet. We've gotten one user created, well, one EA created one, we believe. And we got Cravon LeBlanc. So there's still some defensive bangers in there. I think we're getting free safety Calvin tomorrow. This is what his projected stats would be like based on the director. Now, guys, shout out to the director. As always, make sure to go subscribe to his channel. Follow him on Twitter. Awesome guy. Very cool. Very nice. Always willing to help. He's, like I said, I've asked him, guys, before you guys say anything. I've asked him if I could use these screenshots. He's told me on multiple occasions I could. Just give him credit. So, link will be down below. Hit him up, subscribe to his channel. Now, anyways, Calvin Johnson, awesome stats he's gotten him. So 95 speed, 94 excel, 90 tackle, 96 play rec, 94 pursuit, 96 man coverage, 98 zone coverage, and 99 hit power. So in my opinion, Calvin more than likely probably have like a 95, 96 hit power. I don't think it'll be that high, but the other stats are pretty spot on. He's going to be a zone hawk that's six foot five. Now guys, remember, a lot of people like to play Madden this way, like deep post, deep outs, seam routes. Guys like Calvin, even if you burn him, you know that animation when like you get burnt down the seam and the safety takes like it takes an angle and like he tries to pick it off but he just misses it a six foot five calvin will not miss that he will jump that route every time he will jump plenty of routes even if you have him burnt a little bit he will jump that so he's going to be a stopper over the like he's gonna stop a whole half of the field with his height and speed and reach because remember his arm is very long as well gonna be a very beastly card i do expect this one to come out tomorrow now since we got two offensive last week i believe we'll probably get two defensive this week so for the next card we're going to get i think it'd be cool if they give us the both out of position players tomorrow Mike Evans would be an awesome now guys Mike Evans is a guy that I actually might pick up for the squad if he, when he comes out 96 speed 98 excel 93 agility 99 jumping 92 play rec 99 zone 99 man sorry 98 zone, 99 man and 94 press I actually think his press will be a little bit higher probably like a 96 now pretty much with this card chemmed up and with sprinter he will get to 99 speed 99 excel no 97 play rec he'll have 99 zone 99 man and 99 press this card is going to be insane not to mention he's six foot five this is pretty much night train lane that's taller gonna be more agile gonna be a better catcher which is hard to, hard to beat he's one of the hit power this card if you put him in night train lane on the same on the same field at the same time with deon sanders they're going to make people cry they're going to destroy people their press is going to be ridiculous they're going to be they're, they're locked down they're crazy these are athletic beast i think this would be a great one and now for the last one i think tomorrow will be a perfect time for julio jones calvin mike evans and julio is the wide receiver and remember this julio is going to be insane we've seen pre-release footage of him with people who have pulled them early because well, got him early because they made him this julio is looking quite quite insane six foot three 97 speed 99 jumping 96 catching 97 catching traffic 97 spec catch 99 short route running and 99 medium route running 95 deeper running now, let me show you guys what he actually looks like because remember there is a confirmed copy of him so real quick this was the actual confirmed copy of mike evans i want to show you guys them both to compare the stats like i said 96 press actually that worked out and the stats are pretty much identical the director was spot on with these stats but now let's see the julio jones as these are the confirmed julio jones stats 97 speed 99 jumping 96 catching 98 catch traffic 98 spec catch 99 short route running 99 medium route running and 96 deep route running now in my opinion Guys, this Julio Jones right here is going to be one of the best wide receivers in Madden. Probably the best wide receiver. He's gonna Kem W's gonna have max catching, max route running, and max speed. The whole card's gonna be 99. He's gonna get a human joystick, gonna get insane abilities. This card overall is going to be a monster. Like crazy. I think everything's gonna be 99. With Sprinter Speed 99. With uh if you put West Coast on him, West Coast on him, plus John Madden passing, these are all 99 his route running as well with john madden passing west he might actually fall it's like a 97 98 on the deep route running sadly but guys this card is just overall insane i think this card is awesome highly recommend you guys pick up julio jones if you can't afford him i guess that's about it for the video remember mutt rewards tomorrow we got the draft promo like the draft night version of the promo tomorrow night at 8 p.m eastern time and we got golden tickets tomorrow gonna be a super super fun day hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you did subscribe to the channel turn on that noti bell boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up as always if you did enjoy and comment down below, guys. Say what's up. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out. Peace.